Oh, my friends, my friends. I just got this in. Massive implications. New evidence calls into questions timing of human arrival in North America. Massive implications. They got here on Thursday instead of Friday. I mean, this is crazy. The stuff I show, I think, has massive implications. Nobody cares. I guess giant DNA-tested human beings have no uh, really massive change. Although this is a three foot long fingertip, that's the fingernail, blood supplies, the pad that bumps to the next finger. I smashed off this part and it still has fingerprints on it, but I suppose that's not massive enough of a change. But it was pretty massive as far as I'm concerned. All right, that's the finger tip that I just showed you, and this is the grip skin, which is <laughs> these ridges, one ridge is the size of my fingertip. Right? And they, I bop, pop, broke that off so I could get DNA, and I had a DNA tested. Now, that's kind of massive change as far as I'm concerned. I extracted the samples, and they were dense, and I took them directly from arteries, and I know exactly what I'm doing. There was three tests, and they were dense and excellent quality DNA. This was done, as, I think, basically was the first one I ever done on ancient humans, for sure. And, um, and here it was right here. Excellent quality DNA was obtained from that just gigantic fingertip I showed you, and the lung I'll show you in a second. And I think that's pretty massive change. That's a left hand. Stick your left hand out like that. That's your bumper pad around. That's the little cleave between your pads. Your thumb goes off this way. Your little fingers go that way. You have a tendon that runs down here. This silver stuff is a grip skin exactly like the stuff that I broke off that fingertip. You you have grip skin, it's called. Well, they call it friction skin, grip skin. And it's the layer of skin that's on your fingers and your toes and your feet and the palms of your hand is what does all the work. It's literally keratinized, rubbery, heavy-duty, heavily silicon-infused tissues that protect you. That's why they're there. It's a whole different issue than the rest of your body skin rocks that are actually lungs I think that's kind of massive change this is a lung I took I drilled deep into here and took out a sample and sent it off to be tested and that was part of that three tests and this was human the big hand I just showed you was human and the big fingertip I showed you was human this lung I didn't bother to get DNA tested because it just happens to have blood running out of it so what's the difference nobody cares about it anyway I've shown this to everybody nobody not a single even not even a question how did you do it how did this happen what did you, just go read page 37 and don't ever bother us again that's this that's the education we have system we have right now it's uh, in my mind is uh, very very disgraceful